They're being remembered as loving, caring kids. Tonight, friends and family mourn the loss of two Vista Ridge High School students killed Friday in a car crash. Now, that accident happened, as we said, on Friday on Palmer Lane, just south of Ranch Trails Court. Police say the car they were in crossed the median and was hit by oncoming traffic. KITV's Cassie Gallo is following the story for us tonight, and she joins us now live in the newsroom with the latest. Cassie. Well, Erica, we're told the two students had been dating for about a year, and today those that knew them gathered paying tribute to the high school sweethearts. Family and friends huddled together in Cedar Park, mourning two teenage lives cut short. And I know they're happy up there together. Crosses, flowers, and balloons remember the high school sweethearts. 17-year-old Taylor Letzer and 18-year-old Nathaniel Gomez were killed in a car crash Friday night. I was, I was like, no, this isn't happening. Like, it's not real. She's here. Like, I'm going to see her. And, like, I know she's not. Police markings show where Lesser's car crossed over the median into oncoming traffic. Both Taylor and Nathaniel were wearing seat belts and pronounced dead on scene. He made us proud. He was a hard worker. Michelle Gonzalez found out she lost her oldest son through a knock on the door every parent fears. We thought that we were dreaming. I thought it was a dream. I, I couldn't. Not my Nathaniel. I couldn't. Nathaniel and Taylor were students at Vista Ridge High School. Friends called the couple inseparable and remember them as kind and loving. She was really outgoing. She was super sweet, really nice. Um, she had a kind heart. He always cared for other people. He was so selfless and he had an amazing sense of humor. He was always smiling. Remembered by his smile, but Saturday's memorial filled with tears as family and friends said goodbye. The Leander Independent School District will have available counselors on Monday on campus for students if needed. Reporting live in the newsroom, Cassie Gallo, KI TV News.